Hello families, my name is Richard Salmon. I'm the principal at Leameda School. I wanted to take a moment to go over some important information regarding September 21st, which will be the first opportunity for face-to-face -face instruction here at Leal. Um, all families that filled out surveys requesting face-to-face -face instruction have already been contacted. And if, if, you, if you feel you filled out the survey and you weren't contacted, you can call our school at 989-2400 and we'll help you with that. But the survey is currently closed and those that selected face-to-face uh, -face instruction starting on Monday have already been contacted. If you as a family selected to continue virtual instruction, then all you need to do on Monday is log back on like you've been doing all year long and we will meet the needs of all your students. On October 5th through uh, October 14th, there'll be a new survey that we need all our families to fill out and that survey will help us determine which families want to select face-to-face -face instruction or online instruction for our second semester. So it's important that on October 10th, you look at our website, look at our district website, and be sure you fill out those surveys. Uh, it's important to keep our, our school safe, to keep our students safe, our teachers safe, and our staff safe and healthy. We've done a lot of things here at Leal Middle School to get ready for you on Monday. Let me demonstrate some of the things that we've done to make sure your students are safe. Hello parents, as you can see, we've set up all of our classrooms for face-to-face uh, -face instruction, making sure that we're maintaining social distancing and we're providing plexiglass screens for the protections of our students. It is required that all staff and all students uh, wear masks, so we expect you to bring that in. And for your kiddos, they, they need to bring their own water uh, in a hydro flask or a, or a water bottle, but only water, no, no restaurant cups or Gatorade bottles or sodas, only water, parents. And it needs to be in a clear container or in a water bottle. This is one of our classrooms. We've kept our, our hallways clear of ob any obstacles. And as you can see, we have stickers on the floor and we are sectioning off areas to make sure our students have plenty of room to walk. And there'll be administrators and there'll be uh, teachers and staff helping with our traffic flow to make sure our students are safe. We know that lunchtime is an important time for our students and unfortunately, and un under normal circumstances, they would be able to meet with their friends and talk, but we've done everything we can to duplicate that setting, but while maintaining student safety. So all of our, of our students will be able to enjoy lunch in a safe environment. Uh, they'll be able to see their friends and be able to partake in the lunchroom. The cafeteria ladies are ready. We're ready for them. And we think we're gonna have an excellent uh, lunch time for all our students. All right, families, we do expect visitors to be coming to our campus, but we, we have done all that we can to make sure we're maintaining campus and student safety. Should you need to come visit uh, our students or need to drop off any information, as per our safety guidelines, we're gonna ask you to, to do some self uh, checking on your self screening on your any symptoms you may have and unfortunately should you answer yes to any of those uh, self screening sim sy symptoms then we cannot allow you to enter the building to make sure we are safe with our kiddos thank you again families that that's just a brief glimpse of some of the things we've been doing here at our campus Every classroom is ready, hallways are ready. We're ready for your kiddos. We're gonna make sure we keep all our staff and students and teachers all safe. Uh, just some final things. I'm gonna show a few slides regarding uh, student self-assessment. And it's important families that you do these self-assessments every day. And there's information on that self-assessment should you need to call our school and let us know what's going on health-wise in your families. So again, thank you for for spending the time to look at this video and we're excited about Monday.